this morning to reflect on the life of a fellow student found dead in a burned out car last week in a rural area. Now the Butte County Sheriff's Office is investigating Mark Thompson's death as a homicide. Action News Now reporter Brian Johnson sat down with some of his friends today. Brian, what did you find out about Thompson? Hear the word activist, but today a Chico State graduate student and member of the Cross Cultural Leadership Center described Thompson as a change agent. That stuck out to me, and I'm told Thompson always stuck out from everyone else. It's pretty. It's hard. It's pretty tragic to hear. The reason why it hurts more is because. Um, we don't know the circumstances of, of what happened. What we do know is that 25-year-old Chico State student Mark Thompson's burned body was found in a car fire near Mountain House last week. How Tonga won't speculate on what may have happened, but she's more than happy to talk about her friend and fellow activist, or as she likes to call him, a change agent on issues of diversity and social justice, who used his powerful and loud voice to work towards change, to challenge others on Chico State's campus. If Mark was in the room, you knew he was in the room. If Mark was a part of conversation, you knew he was a part of conversation. He would nag you and it'd get annoying, but at the same time, he'd be right and it'd make you even more upset. Thompson, a Norville native, arrived at Chico State from Butte College. He joined the Cross-Cultural Leadership Center and the Multicultural Affairs Council, where he served as commissioner from May 2012 to May 2013. While there, he never shied away from making that powerful and sometimes abrasive voice heard. Tonga remembers an AS meeting on business casual attire. Who's to say what is professional for me? Those are the kind of conversations that Mark would have. He was so representative because he was a student of color. He came from an underserved community. He was a first generation college student. As a man of color, Tonga sees Thompson's death as symptomatic of a larger issue, the death of another young black man. That was so embedded in the work of change and so embedded in the work of diversity to lose their life and then there's suspicion of foul play. Um, I think there's just a lot of unanswered questions um, and it incites fear. A young, local, powerful agent of change now gone. A fund has now been set up for Thompson's funeral. We posted that information on our website. Reporting for Action News Now, I'm Brian Johnson.